So today's video is on what I believe are the top coins to buy in December. I might do a couple parts of this because there's just so many and I don't like adding a bunch of coins to one video. You know that. I want to keep it as short as possible. The, the first coin I'm going to talk about, super low market cap. It's already on a great exchange. Super exciting. And my second one is one of my favorite coins that I talked about a few months ago. And I'm so excited just to let you know that it... Just wait and see. Hey there, YouTube. I'm Jean with CryptoPix. So, of course, let me start off with just saying happy Thanksgiving to anybody in the United States. I'm sure all of you are super full, maybe gone and stand in those huge lines for Black Friday. I went to Target. It was ridiculous. I swear this line was probably like 1,000 feet. I didn't buy anything, but... That's ridiculous. And again, thank you so much to my new and my old subscribers. You guys are awesome. I appreciate you so much. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button if you haven't already. And check in my description below. My Discord channel's in there. It's getting super active now. I have a few people that I've added as admin to help get the conversations going. And anybody that's active can get the admin status and we can just talk and have fun. Well, let's get going on our first coin. So our first coin is one that one of my friends in this, this chat I have is super bullish on, keeps on trying to get me to jump in. And now I'm just waiting for the proper time to jump in because I do believe this one has huge potential, especially in the upcoming month, Genesis Vision. So what is Genesis Vision's project idea or their vision? <laughs> they are a decentralized trust management platform built on blockchain technology and smart contracts so what is trust management we kind of need to go over that before we go more in depth that boils down to basically investors transferring money to a financial manager and then they wait to receive profits so genesis vision wants to unite exchanges brokers traders and investors into a decentralized open and fair network making the financial market even more global than it already is but what makes this technology special is through smart contracts, they're able to have an automated and transparent system for investment and profit distribution. So through transparency, you can ensure that one person can't just use the system for their own personal gain. So what about their coin use? So their coin is GVT, and this is used for all investment operations, profit distribution, and manager tokens trading on the internal exchange. But what's interesting about this project is that along with GVT, each manager will own their own token, like I mentioned a little bit before, and can only be traded on the internal exchange. So what about their market cap? This is where I personally get super excited. And I know my friend that is all about this gets super excited also. We're looking at 10 million market cap. That's it. 3.7 million circulating supply, 4.4 million total supply, so super small supply. And so what's the difference? There's 11% of those tokens, 488,000 are reserved for the team and they're frozen for one year. 5%, 221,000 of those tokens are reserved for the Genesis Vision Fund, which they're gonna be unfrozen after the platform releases. And the other exciting part, the exchanges they're on, they're already on Binance, which you guys all know my favorite exchange they're on kucoin and ether delta they're also on hit btc but the volume is super low there so a huge positive it looks like their majority of their tokens are already in supply and the supply is itty bitty awesome exchange okay just two two big things in my opinion so now why am i personally excited about genesis vision first like I was just talking about, their market cap is super low. I mean, I personally believe, and again, my friend, think this token could easily hit $20 super soon. I mean, it's super new. I think it just came out like November 17th or something. And it, it just jumped on a few exchanges. And, and Binance, we're used to like Cryptopia or Coin Exchange or just on Ether Delta. This one's already on Binance. How exciting is that? It's kind of like Quantstamp right off the bat jumped right on to Binance. We know Binance puts quality coins. So why am I personally excited for Genesis Vision? 
First, they have a super duper low market cap. I believe this token could easily hit $20. It's super new. It's already on Binance, which we already know Binance has some quality coins. It's actually one of Binance's lowest market cap coins that caught my eye right away. Checked it out. I like this project. They already have 400 partner brokers. So they have an active client base ready once they get the platform going. And then they got some great advisors. They got Charlie Shrem and just so many others. Go check it out. I'm sure you'll be impressed like I was. So to summarize Genesis Vision, overall, myself and a few of my friends are super impressed with, with GVT. And all of us have jumped in or want to jump in at least. They're already on our favorite exchange, Binance. They have some great advisors. And probably the most important part, the market cap is tiny. $10 million. It's ridiculous. 50 million, that's times 500 million, that's times 10. We're looking at some huge gains here. And I really think they could hit $20. Let me know. What do you think of Genesis Vision? You think they have the potential to hit $20? Let me know, comments, or send a message. Still lacking the messages from people. Come on, guys. Now, my next coin, one of my favorite tokens of all of them, WAN Chain. I love this project and I am so excited for this de December which they have some huge news, which I'm going to let you know what that is. This one's exciting, guys. I hope a lot of you got in in October if you were able to watch my, my videos or just knew about them in general. So WAN Chain's project idea, they want to implement cross-chain transfers of assets by setting up connections between accounts of different blockchains and providing a framework for financial applications based on digital currency and digital assets. It's also a blockchain network that can independently operate, allowing anyone to develop financial apps to satisfy their needs. So of course, WANChain's coin use, which is WAN coin, both cross-chain and intra-chain transactions consume a certain amount of WAN coin. WAN coin is used for security deposits for the cross-chain verification nodes. And so the more volume on the WANChain network then the higher the value of their token. So WAN Chain's market cap. We're looking at 37 million market cap. There's 107 million circulating supply, or there will be once the tokens are released, and then 210 total supply. So a little over half of the WAN coins are gonna be circulating when the WAN coin is actually released. The ICO was around 37 cents per coin and of course it hasn't been released yet so we don't have any exchanges yet i'm hoping fingers crossed for a good exchange maybe binance that would be amazing just like quant stamp so why am i excited for wan chain and you know and i can tell you right now i am super excited about this coin number one they have the best team of any coin in my opinion the best team even better than than bat any, any other coin I've covered, this team is number one, in my opinion. And they just added six more members, and four of them are superstars. Ridiculous. Like, they, they made the best team even better. Then they had the mainnet release. That's planned for December, meaning they will have an actual working product, and that's when the coins are supposed to be released. And that's when the ICO members, such as I, will get our Wang coins. And then finally, if you're watching Quant Stamp and Power, you can see how powerful a good ICO can actually be and how much they're actually pumping. Of course, there's, there was a correction on Quant Stamp, but it's still a lot higher than ICO. And just if you were to got into the, the coin right when it came out, you'd still be up over 100%. So I fully expect the same thing from WanChain, but better because they're already going to have a working product out. They are waiting to release the coins once they have a working product. So number one, the hype is definitely there. They had no discounts and they have a working product. So again, the exchange is important. I hope, please let them be on a good exchange. Even if it's Cryptopia, as long as it's not Ether Delta, which again, I can work with that. But if it is on there, I don't think it will show as much growth as it would if it was on course Binance. So to summarize, when Chain, it's been one of the most hype coins I've ever covered. And I'm so excited for this main net release and this for this token to actually hit the exchange. I've been waiting for a while. <laughs> I consider them to have the best team of all coins that I've covered, all coins I've researched. Their market cap is a bit high at 37 million, but it still has so much potential. 
I, I know this can be one of the top coins for 2018. I didn't add it yet just because it's technically not out. I didn't want people to kind of be mad that I, I put a coin out there that, that was still technically an ICO. But I do plan on personally jumping in on Wan Chain once his exchanges. I do have some ICO, but I'm going to try to get in as early as possible and be watching this as close as I possibly can. So are you going to jump into Wan Chain? I know so many of you know this coin is super hyped. Let me know. Again, comment, messages, come to the Discord. Let's talk this out. We can we can track this together. Make sure we're in it the second that it comes on the exchange. So those are my two coins. Genesis Vision, super low market cap, super high potential, and Wan Chain. One of the most hyped coins that should be coming out with a mainnet release in December. Super exciting. Let me know in the comments. Send me a message to Discord. What do you think of those two coins? I appreciate all you guys. Smash that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you next time.